two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? Today we're going to take odd numbers and add them to even numbers, or even numbers and add them to odd numbers. And we're gonna find out what happens when we do that. Let's get started. Take a look at our addition chart. I wanna emphasize a particular diagonal here. It's a diagonal that starts with this number one and then goes down. You see three, five, seven, nine, eleven, thirteen, fifteen, seventeen, and nineteen. Okay, so recall that each of these uh, numbers are this uh, represent the sum. Those are the sum from adding two add ends. For example, that number five comes from adding the add end three with the add end of two. Three plus two is five. Great, so what I'm gonna do is um, complete all of these uh, addition sentences right here. So what we have is a three plus two equals the five. And let's go ahead and figure out how each of these other sums were found, okay? And I'm just going to erase uh, these bars here and we'll do it just with our fingers, okay? So how do we get the one in this diagonal? We add one and zero. And then how do we get the three? That's two plus one. How do we get the seven? That's four plus three. The nine comes from the add end five plus the add end four. 11 comes from 6 plus 5. 13 comes from 7 plus 6. Almost there. 15 is 8 plus 7. And 17 comes from 9 plus 8. And 19 comes from 10 plus 9. Okay, now what I want you to observe about each of these sums is that every single one of them has an even add end and an odd add end. Let's review. Remember, even numbers are numbers that end in the, num in the values 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8. Odd numbers are numbers that end in 1, 3, 5, 7, and 9. So going back, you see in the, let's go ahead and start with the 3 plus 2. Do you see that 3 is odd and 2 is even? So we have an odd number plus an even number and look at our result. It's odd. Okay, let's keep going. 4 is even, 3 is odd, and our result is odd. Five is odd, four is even, the result is odd. Okay, so let me help you understand what's happening here. Every single one of these sums is an odd result. We got odd, one, three, five, seven, nine. Aren't these all odd numbers? Yeah, and as it turns out, anytime you add an odd number with an even number or an even number with an odd number, right? It doesn't matter which order you add them the result will always be odd. And this is just a demonstration of that. So, now we know when we add an odd number with an even number or an even number with an odd number, we're going to get an odd result.